What's up you guys? Welcome back. I am so excited for today's video because I feel like all our videos lately have been, you know, pregnancy content based, you know, twins based and this video is just a good old fashioned vlog. This vlog is actually really, really long. We just finished editing it and I think it came out to like 50 minutes and that's without an intro and an outro. So make sure y'all grab a snack, grab a snacky snack, grab your popcorn, grab a drink because we have such a long video for you guys. And I honestly just love this vlog so much. I was smiling ear to ear. As you guys know, we just recently went back home so we can do our gender reveal with our family and also, you know, celebrate Kayvon's second birthday with our family. And it was just really, really fun. And I'm so glad I got all those memories on camera. So make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up and also subscribe down below. But before we get into today's video, I just wanna give a huge, huge shout out to today's sponsor, which is Albert. Let's talk about my Albert card. I love the fact that it's so sleek and beautiful. But besides the fact, I love how it looks. It's so easy to use and it's also free to sign up. This banking app, again, is just so easy to use overall, but I truly believe this is the new card for millennials and Gen Z because again, they just make it so easy to use the app. Let's talk about how some banking apps are literally stuck in, I don't even know, 2008. Like they are just on it with all the amazing technology. Their app is super easy to use, but I wanna talk to you guys about specific reasons why I love this card. So first of all, there are no overdraft fees. Dreaded $35 overdraft fees. How does that make sense? Please explain to me how it makes sense that your bank account doesn't have enough money, so you get penalized and get charged more money. Albert is the complete opposite. They actually spot you $250 when you need it. So let's say you're at the gas station pumping your gas and you totally forget that you don't have enough money in your account. Instead of most traditional banks charging you a fee, Albert does literally the opposite and spots you up to $250 instantly. So they just go ahead and take that out of your next paycheck and they also don't charge any interest. So I love the fact that they truly care about their users. Pumpkin? Pumpkin? Blippy. Yeah, you're wearing Blippy. Blippy? Blippy? You want to show them your Blippy jammies? You want to show them your... Yeah, there's Daddy over there, I'm Mommy. And Mommy. Mommy. Here, you want to show them how you do your makeup? Show them. Do you want to show them how do Mommy's makeup? Thank you, Bunny. Thank you for my touch up. And with most traditional bank accounts, they actually charge you for having a savings and a checking account. As we all know, you have to have a minimum balance in those accounts and they also charge maintenance fees. Albert doesn't do any of that. They also offer cash back on some of your purchases on your favorite stores like Walmart, McDonald's, Starbucks, and you can also get paid up to two days early with Albert. I also love the fact that Albert helps you save automatically. So instead of just opening a traditional savings account and just having to remember to put money into it, Albert will actually take a look at your income and expenses and see where you can move some money to your savings account and they'll do it automatically. So over time, you'll be surprised that over time it will accumulate. Sometimes they'll move as little as a few dollars at a time and you'll just see your savings just start to increase. So we can all admit that managing our money can be very hard and stressful, especially when it's something so new to us, especially all of us in this age range, you know, our early 20s, you know, just graduating high school it is such a foreign concept to a lot of us so I love the fact that they have a genius team so they have a team of experts there to help you manage your money and answer any financial questions that you might have so that also comes with your Albert account and I cannot say enough good things about Albert I truly believe it's a bank account that everybody needs but specifically I know I have a lot of young people watching me a lot of you guys DM me all the time about how I purchased a house so young and things like that so I love the fact that we can talk about things like finances and money management, and this is definitely something that I recommend a lot of you guys check out. You guys can click the link in my description box to download the Albert app today, and for a limited time only, when you guys open a checkings account and connect a qualifying direct deposit, you guys will get $150. So again, this is only for a limited time only, so make sure you guys take advantage of this offer and click the link down below in my description box, and let's get into the rest of today's video. Must be towed for taxi takeoff and landing. 
If you have a carry on, place all right. it all the way under the seat. I was sorry, I was telling Nas, I wish our flight could have been luggage, just one hour later, because then I would could have took on to the park for an hour. Oh, he's done. Uh, Say hi, guys. Hi. Say, I'm on an airplane. Hi. Hey folks, don't use the lavatory just any time you feel like it, please. No, no, no. <laughs> what? What did he say like that? Is this a play about us? <laughs> Into the buckle and pull the strap so it's tight across your hips. Funny. To open your seatbelt, lift the top of the buckle and... to see your grandma. I'm about to go see Emmy. Mommy. Let's go say hi to Emmy. Oh my goodness! <laughs> 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 I love you. Hi. Hi, mommy. Hi, guys. You were saying Emmy, Emmy. Oh, it smells good. Hi, mommy. Hi, mom. Oh, Shadows is here? Yeah. <gasps> yeah, baby. Hi, Come on. Come on. Come on. I didn't know she was here already. Oh. Babe, remember these days? They're coming up yeah. again. Oh my, my sister, oh, it's knocked over. My sister-in-law's breast milk. Guys, I'm about to meet my niece for the first time. I'm so excited. Wait, let me wash my hands. I don't want to look at her just yet. No, 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 baby. Is it baby here too? Mm. KK, you see baby? Yeah, you saw baby. You hug baby, hug baby. Hey, one. KK, hug. Hey, You're going to be a big brother soon. Okay. Okay, okay, look at her stinkers. Look, stinkers. Look at the hosies. Baby, hug, 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 hug. Okay, okay, okay. Look, okay, okay. Give her a hug, hug, hug. Be gentle, gentle. God, I hope we have a little deal. <laughs> Mom, she's so cute, Mom and Little. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
I want to see these for little awesome. fish. Yeah. 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 Awesome. These great. Be a be a carpet for them. Yeah, yeah, carpet. Yeah. Her eyes are gray. Mmm. I miss that baby scent. I want to smell that breath after a bottle. I want to smell that little breath after a bottle. Let me see the toes. Let me see the toes. Peel those socks off, would you? Oh! Oh my god, look at the toes. Shut the bug. Guys, these are the tiniest toes. Kay, kay. Her, look, her toes, her toes are like ours. The second one is longer. Kay, kay, look at look, look her toesies. Kay, kay, look, look. Look at her toesies. Do little, do little piggy? This look, right little here. piggy? Piggy, piggy. Piggy, this little piggy? Yeah. Give her a kiss, mama. Hey, mom. KK, you want to give the baby a kiss? Want to give Shainaz a kiss, your cousin? Ron is playing. He's busy with the car. So delicate. Mm -hmm. I forgot what it feels like to like touch a delicate baby. We're used to a meaty tank. Ron was delicate for like two months. Yeah. Oh, look, mom's saying, like, nope. Nope. You're too big for this, Baba. Oh, yeah. no, funny. Go to that one. Go to that one, Mom. But that's the broken one? Yeah, yeah. Come here. So that one broke, you guys, and then yeah. Fisher come. Price sent hey, them another you one. You want it here? No. I like, go on the broken you one. Want that? My shoulder is big. Sh <laughs> 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 uh, Vaughn, you're too heavy, mister. Yeah. Look at Vaughn. Yeah. Look at Vaughn trying to be a baby. Yeah, they like this? You want to lay like this? I'm sorry. I thought you wanted to lay down. No, she wants to be up. It's a broken one. Walk around. Pepsi? Yeah. Hi, Pepsi. 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 Kayvon was like that once upon a time. Kayvon, Kayvon. Is ever this little? How big is she right now? She is nine and something. Yeah, I was born like the first month. Kayvon, let's bring the milk for the shainas, come on. Go get milk, my boss? So get milk. Sheer, sheer, very shainas. Bia, 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 bia shainas. Kayvon, Kayvon. Bia, bia, sheer, very shainas, sheer, sheer, sheer. So we just got to the park, brought little Shahnaz with us. And guys, look at how big this side is. I'm pretty sure this is the hey, biggest. Hey, babe. And I'm about to get you. Go, ready? One, two, three. This is the biggest slide I think Vaughn has ever went down. Marty? <laughs> Hi, baby. <laughs> ready, Bubba? KK. Okay, here comes daddy. This stroller is so good. This is the one that we got in that Bye Bye Baby um, video that we did. This is by Graco. It literally glides so good. And this is her car seat, by the way. So it's like the car seat, we just clipped it on. It literally took like two seconds, but this is a really good stroller. Get Lonnie all the way up there. Oh my god, you're way too big for all that, babe. Look at my baby. Look at her. Here, come get her from this side so we can see her face. I think she's getting hungry again. She didn't drink her bottle. Yeah, look, Susie, she's eating. She's hungry. My brother's here, by the way. He's playing with Vaughn. He's pulled up. Guys, these nails are definitely not newborn friendly. I literally forgot. I'm like trying to open the buckle. I'm like trying to put her in. I'm like, I'm about to scratch her. Good thing we have milk. Mm -hmm. I told her that I'm going to make her the best dressed girl in Columbus. That's my duties as an uncle. Keep her fresh. 
Keep her okay. cute. She needs, she needs a nap in milk, so we're heading home. Faster? Huh? No? Which way? Yeah. Beep beep. Mom's driving. Yeah. Beep beep. Yeah, beep beep. <laughs> car, car. There we go. Signal, signal. Signal. This is called signal. Go up, signal, see, yay. You want up, Vani? Up. Here, Bubba. Here, baby. We both have short arms. I don't have long arms like Daddy. There you go. Of course, it falls to the floor. Okay. Here, buddy. Is limited and registration is required. Hello guys, welcome to Ohio Day 2. Um, we are currently on our way to go see Mama and Baba. It's kind of like our schedule while we are here. Um, so Vaughn is staying like fully at Mel's parents' house since we're just here for a week. And we all as a family collectively decided to do that just because as you guys know, my family is able to come visit way more often. My parents are able to come out and visit since they're retired. They're able to come out much more often than Mel's parents. So we figured like he could just stay there and while his parents work throughout the day Vaughn is gonna go over to mom and Baba's house go to the park play all that stuff so that is the routine we made and it's working out for us so we're just on our way over right now to go see mom and Baba um, Baba and Yasmin haven't seen Vaughn yet so we're really excited for that after we get our food we decided to get pot belly if you know, you know, their sandwiches are so good. Pretty much yesterday, we just, what did I do yesterday? So after I stopped vlogging, I just had a video I had to work on, like I just had to upload it, but I forgot how long the upload speed is here in Ohio and it literally took like an hour of like, just sitting there watching this upload and then for some reason that video if you guys have ever uploaded to youtube it has that like checks process and for some reason this checks like took so so long it took like another hour so i was supposed to upload that video yesterday it didn't really work out so i just have it on listed i'm gonna post it today but after we did that we just went back to mama's house I actually went by myself because my mom cooked i ate um because vaughn was napping when i left and then paula actually came over and we got ice cream we got some graters we just talked caught up and yeah that was basically my night yesterday and now today what we have planned is just hanging out with mom and baba just hanging out with family tomorrow i have a hair appointment i need it so bad i'm also getting a scalp treatment i'm excited for that i've never gotten one um yeah, i'm just gonna get my hair done tomorrow i need to get a spray tan and then we have one more day and then friday is when our friends start coming i need my hair done so so bad you guys my hair is so dirty i'm not even gonna say how long i've gone without washing my hair because y'all are gonna y'all are gonna shred me because i even tell my friends who like go a long amount of time not washing their hair when i told them the amount of time they're like that is actually very impressive but i'm telling you guys i have trained my hair like my trick my hair it's also because my hair is naturally like thick and curly i feel like it can withstand going a long time without getting washed and it like doesn't get super oily or dirty or anything like that so definitely the best thing to do is train your hair and just not go a long time without washing it because your hair will get used to it well at least in my experience i actually just realized that i never talked to you guys about our flight experience with a toddler our first time flying with a toddler and i think it's because you know when something traumatic happens and your mind kind of like blocks it out and no, i'm just kidding but it was a very humbling experience that is the best word i could think of to use for it it is the most humbling experience when you are the parents with the screaming toddler for once ever since i became a parent myself like screaming kids don't bother me i can definitely tune it out and especially knowing that like you can just pop in some headphones like a screaming toddler like doesn't even phase me okay. but when it's your own Oh my gosh. I don't want to make it seem like Vaughn was this huge headache or anything like that. But I will say, like, if I was to rate this experience, like, he had his moments. Like, you guys saw in my story, there were moments where he was just sitting in a seat, sleeping, watching TV, watching his iPad. But then when the meltdowns happened, they happened okay and again it's nothing we can control it's just you know the terrible twos it's in their developmental 
process to act like that. That's what I was trying to explain to Mel because he was like freaking out. Like, why is he acting like this? I'm like, babe, it's like part of their, you know, milestones. Like, it's completely normal. We just have to stay calm. And honestly, either people will like completely ignore you or like some of like the older people like trying to help us out. Like, give us candy to give him and all that stuff. But what really, really got us, the first flight wasn't that bad at all. So we had two, two and a half hour flights. We had to stop in Dallas. Um first flight wasn't that bad he had his few meltdowns here and there he honestly had his meltdown before the flight even started so i feel like he got like all of his emotions out and he was just chilling the rest of the flight and it also doesn't help he had no play time before the flight because literally he woke up we got him ready we went to the airport so he's used to going to the park you know running around for like two three hours a day and he had to sit down in his seat for hours and hours so honestly i think he did a really great job for that reason alone but yeah once the first flight wasn't that bad at all the second flight we had our layover he was chilling then the second flight got delayed which if it got delayed while we were sitting in the gate whatever no big deal it'd actually be perfect von could just run around we could go to an empty gate and von could have just ran around for like an hour no the flight got delayed an hour and a half while we were on the tarmac in the plane you guys imagine sitting in a space this small so we had a whole row with Vaughn he was in the middle so luckily we had that whole row so he wasn't like hitting a person next to us but there was a person in front of us the first flight there was nobody in front of us which was great because if Vaughn like wanted to move around stretch out his legs he hit the front seat who cares there was no one in front of us the second flight there was an old lady in front of us and anytime like Vaughn would have a meltdown and like flare his legs and kick her seat oh my god like the thing is I tried my best to like my thing, I don't care when toddlers are acting up, you know, like that's a normal toddler, but I hate when their parents like don't try to stop it. That's why I tried my best to be like pretty loud and be like, don't do that, Vaughn, don't kick her seat. Like, so I wanted the lady in front of us to know, like, I'm not condoning this. I'm trying to make it not happen, you know, but if you guys are parents to toddlers and you guys know, when you try to stop it, it just ends up getting like 10 times worse and they just act out even more. So you really just got to like let them let it out. But overall, like once he had like a few of those, he relaxed a little bit, but then he wanted to keep standing up in his seat. That was also a problem in itself. Flight attendant would walk by and they're like, he needs to sit in his seat. And I'm like, we're trying, we're trying. I was telling them about our flight experience. Oh yeah. I was telling Mel, like we are never complaining about flight inconveniences when we're by ourselves ever again. Like I will never complain about a delay when it's just me by myself. It's not that big of a deal. Like when you're with kids and you have delays, but, but. it's a whole nother ball game. But we survived, babe. Yeah, we did, but. We ain't going nowhere with We have fun. to get back home. Let's see what these are hitting for. Cheese curls. All we know is that we are not planning on flying with Vaughn anytime soon. Until he can sit through a, a movie. Yeah, and he can just sit on his iPad oh, and watch a movie. Wow. It's just mommy and daddy going places. Yep. Guys, one thing I remember about Pop Belly, we don't have Pop Belly in California, do we? I don't think I've ever seen one. Um, but they snap on their shakes. I know they have them in New York. We did see one in New York. But they always put a little cookie on top of your shake too. But I'm not even a big shakes girl. But their shakes are always like perfection. Like so thick. You seem to be a big shake girl whenever I get a shake. Hmm. Okay, I'll never order a shake Ironic. myself, but I'll drink Va Vaughn's shake, Mel's shake. Bro, you'll drink Vaughn's too, believe me. I'm sure the girls can agree that when you just sip off of your man's and you don't order your own, the calories don't count. It's like I didn't even drink it. Wow. That's why. That's the... Good to know. That's the loophole. I mean, already warned me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 she oh, knocked me over. <laughs> Oh, baby, right. it's okay. Mom. Okay, mom, be gentle. Noisy, noisy, noisy. Aw, he wants to hug too. Aw, he wants to be a baby too. Aww. he wants to be left I am super auntie. <laughs> I'm not just auntie, I'm super auntie. I'm super auntie. Okay, hey, one? Hey, one. Oh, it's here, mama. It's here. Which one? Baby. Auntie, 
Good morning, guys. It is the third day. We are currently at Easton right now because I need to get a blowout for this hair. I did, ooh, almost dropped my purse. I did rinse my hair this morning just because I went a long time, like I'm not gonna lie, I went a long time without washing my hair and I've been wearing like my hair in like buns and stuff like that. So I was honestly embarrassed for the stylist to like see my hair. So I was like, let me just give it a quick rinse. Mama. Say bye, mommy. Bye, baby. Vani washed his hair this morning too. He looks so handsome, look. No. No? no. Okay, no, he said no. But I'm also getting a scalp treatment. So I'm hoping that feels good. It's good, guys. Um, so I'm just out. Me and Vaughn are going to go out. This is our first time really mobbing around Columbus. You mobbing? Know, we always go out and hang out with each other in L.A. We run errands. But this is our first time doing this, like, where I grew up in the areas where I'm, like, comfortable at. So this is going to be a lot of fun. I thought we were going to Polaris, honestly, and I was going to take him to, like, my favorite spot in Hoover. Oh. And, like, have him, like, walk around on this little trail. But we're not. So we're somewhere that's not really as close to Hoover as I wanted to be. So... Um. Hi, Bye, baby. So Mel doesn't have an outfit for the gender reveal yet. So can you try to find me something to wear, like, to his birthday? Or are we wearing his like? His birthday is just sweats. I know. I don't have sweats, like that. What is your size? Sweatpants. Large sweatpants. Got a lot of junk in the trunk. I'm sure there's a Nike store out here, so. Okay, just send me pictures. Right. Okay, mommy's leaving. Bye, Tay. Mommy loves you. You see his little slip back mm -hmm. Okay, bye guys. Say bye, mommy. Bye, mommy. Bye, baby. Mommy loves you so much. Hello, guys. Got my hair done. Feel like a new woman. Vaughn is like staring into my soul right now as I'm doing this. But guys, she washed my scalp so good. That little soothing scalp treatment felt really, really good. Now we're at one of our favorite Mexican restaurants here in Columbus called El Vaquero. Here's my food. I got the pollo ranchero. So it's like chicken with this cream sauce. We got rice, beans, got my little side of salad, tortillas. Where's the tortillas? Where'd they go? Right here. Oh, Mel stole my tortillas. Yeah. Mel accidentally ordered his food with beef. He didn't say chicken, so we're just waiting for it. So. Yeah. And Vaughn is going in on chips. Uh, That's tortilla. Right? And tortilla. Guys, his hair <laughs> looks so good today. Ow. His hair looks so good. Taking Shanaz's St. Patrick's Day pictures. Got a little outfit. It says, My first St. Patrick's Day. This is her nursery, by the way. Remember we got her those curtains, if you guys remember from the vlog. Chandelier. Luckily Mel had his camera on the car. <laughs> Mel's about to be a newborn photographer. Yeah. Hey, you guys have like uh, chicken stuff? Uh, chicken right here? Chicken? No. Thank you. Thank you. And for you, miss? Well, the medium. Medium. Actually, can I get the well? And I'll give her this one. No, I'll have that. Yeah. It's actually a little too medium for me. There you go. I'll do the well. Guys, a little bit later, I got a spray tan, but you cannot tell with this awful lighting. I look blue for some reason. But we're at this restaurant called Texas State Brazil. In California, we have something like this it's called Fogo de Chao. It's like a what, Brazilian steakhouse. It's like a Brazilian steakhouse. My brother brought us out here for Vaughn's birthday, as you can see. Bonnie? Yeah, Mom. Video. Hello. Baby's at the other grandma's house. Yes, so parents night out. Then we have Mel. We have a grandma here. We have Wangi. Wangi. Bye. 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 So mean. I gotta pick up my hair. Oh, wait. You're so mean. <laughs> I forgot. You Hi, guys. <laughs> I'm here. Hi. I'm sorry. <laughs> you literally were like, Okay, camera. <laughs> Hi guys. So we are 
at Easton right now. I've had graders every day since I've gotten here. Somehow we end up at graders every single time. But yeah, we're all just walking over to get some dessert. And Vaughn looks so cute right now, you guys. Mom put his sweatshirt on him. Yeah. But oh wait. It's mine. Get one? Let me get this mine. Yeah. Yeah. Look at his sweatshirt. Let's go. Look at him. Aww. He looks like uh, yeah, Harry Potter. Potter. Yeah, he looks from Harry Potter. Yeah, he looks like Harry Potter. Yeah. Yeah, ice cream. Yeah, ice cream. Ice cream. You like ice cream? Ice cream. Ladies first, go ahead. Raiders. Kayvon wants to go in the fountain and we're saying no. Look, look. Look, look, look. Uh, My brother was saying he's too strong for us. We can't control him. The only person who can control Vaughn guys is no. If you try to climb in there, you will not be able to make it wet. You can't make it over there. It's a giraffe made out of Legos. Okay, hey, 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 come sit. Come sit on the set. Let me take a picture. Okay, okay, look. Come here, come sit right here. <laughs> he looks so... Just take one of him standing right here, babe. And then get close side in the butt. KK! 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 Uh-uh, KK, KK! No, they gave me one of them bombs. Feel back and pose. There you go, Bubba. Now you got your wristband. KK, where are you going? I guess so. That was a good elevator. KK, who are you going to see? The man? Man! You going to go see Spider Man? Spider Man? Spider Man? Mom! Mom! Gonna go to the Marvel yeah. exhibit. Mom! 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 Spider Man! Slow down, Mom! Slow down. Look, look. KK. First Marvel comic ever published. What year is that? Oh my. Uh, <coughs> Sorry, go ahead. Thank you. Give me the oh, oh, okay. Thank you. Uh, Thank you so much. These are actual fetuses. Look at how little. Two of this right now. Four months. And I'm like, oh, this, is what's, this is what's inside of Nas currently. Look at the jump between three and four months. This thing, you guys, tests smell strength. So let's see. Gonna... Oh my goodness, babe. They're lying. They're lying. He was 124. I just did 124 last time. last time and I pushed harder this time. I pushed way harder this time. Let me try. Let me try. Five. Okay, brace myself. Three. How is that true? How is that true? How is that true? How is that true? Come There's on. no way. That, that's not true. Come on. How did I get 148? He got 117. Well, you also was moving your feet and stuff. You're supposed to keep your back firmly oh. against the back. I got it now. You said you're gonna stay here. Yep. I won't leave you I'll be this for. Uh huh. Go wow. Too tight. Guys, Mel just sat down and he's like, my back is too I tight. A, I have a spasm in my back right oh now. Oh my god. Remember yesterday at Easton when I was going like, 
Like I caught a spasm when I bent down to pick up Vaughn. He like jumped into me and my back tightened up. Oh man, you old man. So this thing measures your heart rate, then you have to press the button so they light up. Ah, I'm wasting footage. So as you can see, Mel's score is 26, Kamaya's 8. Oh my god. You know what mine is, don't play him. This says for children in second grade or older. Y'all did not read. Okay, okay, look at daddy. doing a quick little food break. So I just got a pasta with marinara sauce. I'm gonna share it with Vaughn. Maya and Mel got some chicken fingers and fries. Their fries are really good, by the way. And then Mel's parents are waiting on their sandwiches. Look at my Vani. Hi, bunny. Hi, baby. Food, yeah, we're gonna eat food. You're gonna share with mama. When you get them, we get them started on fries, he's not eating nothing else. Yeah, he's even been loving fries right here. Don't have any mustard? Uh oh. Mm -hmm. You should suck when you come here on a field trip because you could never get this food. Why? I don't think you bring the yep. packed sandwiches. Mm. Really? I don't remember. It was mandatory for field trips. Because even if your parent gave you money, not every kid had money, so they're not gonna be like, well, no, you go ahead and get a pasta while Jimmy eats a cold cut sandwich next to you. I mean, Guys, we were talking about how, like, if you grew up in Columbus, you came here on a school trip. Like, I forgot what grade. Was it every year? Elementary. Though. Elementary, but I also went middle school. I used to come here a lot with summer camps. Yeah, and summer camps. Like, this is like, you would come here as, like, a, you know, school or a camp and stuff. Guys, this was my favorite exhibit in all of Kosai growing up. And it is called progress and you guys I'm gonna show you it's like you go through time like you walk through these city streets Oh, 
Depop, look at me. Depop. Look, look. I'm not Depop. Depop's over there. Look, look at Depop. Mm -hmm. Look at Depop. Depop. It's a vibe right here. Go ahead and meditate, right, Maya. Go ahead and meditate real quick. Let me see. This unrelaxing music. What about this? Playing some? Go ahead and meditate, Maya. Um, what are we doing our meditation class? This is What's up, you guys? We finished up at Kosai and we just drive real quick so we can drop Ron home for his nap. And I left Mel there and everything. So I'm here now with Mama. I feel like I've barely shown Mama on the vlog. And like yes, Mama. we're twins. Twinies. Um, we are at Party City right now, just getting some last minute items for Kayvon's birthday on Sunday. We just want to see like their Hot Wheels selection. The only thing that sucks, you guys, is that his party venue place doesn't allow balloons. That's something I've never heard in my life. Somewhere that's made for birthday parties, mom, doesn't allow balloons. Yeah, the stuff, yeah, when he was young, I do it for you. Well, look, guys, it's the high school I went to. Wait, this is my high school, and that's Mal's high school. Westerville Central, Olentangy High School. I'll always send a picture to Mal, it's cute. Oh yeah, my mom has a, another party to go to because she's Miss Busy today. But yeah, so they don't allow balloons because they have high ceilings and they don't want like balloons to fly to the top, which I understand. So I called them up and I'm like, hey, since that's like the reason, can we just do non-helium balloons? And I feel really bad because the people on the phone, like they were so, so nice. Like they even said themselves, like we know it's like a really silly rule, but they're like, sorry. They're like, we, um, they're like, we would tell people that like they can bring non-helium balloons and other people will come and be like, well, you told us no balloons and they have balloons. And it just kind of became a big like, problem so they just said no balloons period so i'm sitting here trying to figure out how to make like a background look cool without balloons i did get a sign made i have to get that printed but other than that like i have no idea what i could use to decorate What's up, you guys? A mama actually, like, time just creeped up on us, and she. <laughs> I was like, Baba, can I please vlog for a sec? But he's so impatient. Um, so I had to bring her home real quick, but Yasmin's gonna come with me to finish up the rest of the errands. But I did. Oh, I'm like out of breath. I don't know why. But I ordered, um, I don't know if I told you guys, but Vaughn's birthday is Hot Wheels themed. So I ordered these off of Amazon. I got little traffic cones with. Um, where to go? Well, I got them flat. Oh, here we go. I got little traffic cones so we can put these flags in them, but there's no hole in the traffic cone, which is where Baba comes in. And he is gonna make a hole. That was aggressive. Uh, give me that. <laughs> We need something to make it bigger because we have to do like five. Yeah, I have to bring another one. Okay, guys, Baba found another drill. So this is what the centerpieces are looking like. I'm so happy we're able to do this today and not wait until the day of his birthday to figure it out because not only do we have to drill the holes in the cones, I was expecting that though because people did put that in the reviews on Amazon that like the picture is like this, but there was no holes in the cones. So I was like, I know Baba can handle it. So we did a few while I was drilling the holes. But then also it's really hard to like, yes, well, Baba makes it easy. Yeah, no, oh, use I make the it, knife. Look, look, look. No, I know, no. that's what I did over there. Yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, no. oh, yeah. Come on. Oh. Oh. Hi, everybody. Baba's too focused right now to talk to you guys. How you doing? It's in work mode. One day coming, we do birthday for our toy, for my toys. <laughs> I told Baba that's weird to say. He calls the twins his toys. Toy, I want to play with them. Because he wants to play with them. And I'm like, Baba, that's cute, like, <laughs> in your head, but... Uh, maybe, but... And um, Americans are going to think that's weird. No, I, I don't mean that. I, I translate it. I translate it in American. Maybe American don't like it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry for them. As I said, I don't know if I told you guys this, but on the day of his party, we literally only have 15 minutes to set up. So this alone would have taken us like 30 minutes. So I'm just going to have them all ready to go. So we just put them on the table. So we're at the 
this restaurant called High Bank. I've never been here before. Um, we're actually going to be with Grissa and Juan here and Shine. They're on the way here, so we're so excited to see them. But this restaurant is really cool because it's also a distillery, so I'm going to show you guys. We're actually sitting right by the distillery. Oh my God, look Guys, I cannot believe my eyes right now that Rissa and Quan are in Ohio. Hi guys. What? So what? what? With baby Shine? Yeah, I was about to say it's not about us. <laughs> so yeah, guys, I'm shook that they're in Ohio right now. Subber, gender reveal. You guys are the best. We're super excited. Come all the way out, Subber with us. I can't wait to find out the gender. Yeah, we're all just like dying. We cannot wait to find out tomorrow. Paula, what you thinking? It's a girl. There's two, there's two. I know. Two girls or All I know is one's a girl. <laughs> For sure. If you see them every day, share the love. Oh yeah. What's up guys? Today is Sunday. It's our last full day and it's also Kayvon's birthday party. So me and Kamaya went to Office Max to pick up Kayvon's baby careful because Coca scratches. Be careful. Okay. Kayvon sees Coca, but I'm like, Coca's a scratcher, so let's be careful. So yeah, Kamai and I went to Coca, Hi, Coca, 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 he sees Coke. Coca's mean, Papa. I know, Coca can be mean, so you have to be careful when you pet her. Yeah, Paula came to help, but as I was saying, we went to Office Max to pick up Kayvon's sign for his birthday, and I really wanted to make little traffic lights for like, um, to put on his like candy uh, cake table. And Kamaya's helping me. She actually cut these little foam boards for me perfectly. And we are cutting out, and we are cutting out our little traffic lights. Oh my God, I can't get it with my nails. There we go. Yeah, I got it. But yeah, see, it's just gonna be the little lights. Guys, I started gluing this and it was so off center that I couldn't finish. And Daniel was like, I got it. But look, it's off center. Look at that. I made the fine. yellow off center. It looks fine. Sure? Yes, I'm positive. Like, I mean, she went into into it with the confidence, with the confidence crew. It's a it's a it. two year old birthday party. Vaughn is never gonna remember this. Stop. Looking. Look at these two cuties. What'd you say? Yes, your sister. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Summer, you wanna give him a hug? Oh. 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 Bonnie, you're too strong. You are too strong, Bonnie. Oh, it's okay. Oh, okay, Bonnie. Guys, we have Baba out here grilling for us. Look at that, you guys. Oh, that kebab. Hey, man, how are you? Hi everybody. Oh yeah, Mama Please say come hi. eat with us. <laughs> so yeah, we have everybody over for kebabs for lunch. We have Rissa and Connor on the way here. You guys saw Danny and T Bell are here. Here. It's so crazy seeing y'all in our house. Like that's I know, I so love crazy. It. You want to eat? eat? Where the lemon go? Eat. Eat. <laughs> eat. We have chicken kebab. Masa khiyar, which is like a yogurt with cucumbers. This is Sal Shirazi right here. Whoa, thank you. Good. Thank you, Baba, for yeah, cooking for us. Yeah, thank you so much. You're thank you, Baba. Here the vlog. Yeah. Hi, everybody. Yeah, we appreciate yeah. it. Look how cute I, I want to invite you for, for, for lunch, but... These little miniature hands. Look at this handsome little boy. <laughs> a little mouth. Oh. He's enjoying his fruit right now. Oh, he's so mm -hmm. handsome. <laughs> yeah, mom? As we told Chad, he's going to a birthday party today. Look when I say birthday. He dances. Birthday. 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 birthday, birthday. Julie B. Look at him dance. Birthday. Birthday. Hi, handsome. He's excited to party. 
Guys, I'm in the car with Danny and T-Bell. I just brought them to Graders. I'm, which I'm so, so excited. excited for. Danny says she's had Graders like once in her life. I think I might have, but I might not have. Yeah. If you guys didn't know, Danny was actually born in Cleveland. Cleveland. Yeah, so yeah. Ohio. So she's Ohio not new to the Midwest. Midwest. Yes. yes. And we're from like we. I was raised in Chicago. Ty's from yeah. Chicago, yeah, so it's all today. Midwest. Good. Good. Yes. How are you? Got my black raspberry chip. I just had. Um, Danny tried some. She said it was really good. Yeah. She got her cookie, cookie dough. dough. Yeah, you're Ty, going in on that. So I just good. looked over. I was like, damn. <laughs> and Ty got a mid shake. patty shake. Mm -hmm. He is in the St. Patrick mood. <laughs> Here, baby, take your show. Hey guys, we just got to Ooh, well, the party shirt. venue. We are the first people. So this is yes. what we have to work with to decorate with. And look, they have a sign. Can you guys see yeah, it? It's we'll cute. You, yeah. This looks different than what it looked like online. Yeah. So I don't know. It's like it's a lot more colorful. Yeah. yeah. It's like this. We're gonna see, add some zhuzh. Yeah, we're gonna add some zhuzh. So as you guys can see, like you just walk into this room and it's all open. So yeah. you can really like nice. still see everything. And then here's all the kids. There's so much too in the basketball. Yes. Okay. Me and Danny were talking. I'm like, isn't it so crazy that our friendship, like you're right now in my hometown having me set up for my son's birthday party? Like, yeah, I know. How do we get to this point? And you're having twins. And I know. like, I knew you before you were even pregnant, and now we're like at this point. I know it's, it's wild. Crazy. I remember. That's how you guys know Nas is a real one because I don't fuck with anyone. That's what I'm realize. saying. That's she was saying like, on my vlog that I'm a tough cookie to crack. That's, and that's what I'm facts. saying. I was saying on her vlog, vlog. I was like, I'm surprised she even likes me still after that's all this how time. You know, I love you. That's oh. how you know she's a real one because I don't I fuck with fake too. ones. It's like Aries and Sag. I know. That's Which I like. Don't rock with Sag either. I know. She said that her story. Nas is the only Sag I like. What? Yeah. I love you. All right. Yeah, Aries can be too much, so I don't know. Never too so much. Aries are reliable and loyal. And you look are loyal. Who's here I know. To help set up you for Kayvon, okay? Auntie Danny in the building. Yes. Guys, look who's here, my niece, drinking her milk. So, so cute. Guys, we're spending the rest of our night at Top Golf. Okay, guys, we are at Top Golf, and it's so cute. I listed that this was like what we were celebrating is the gender reveal. So, the manager pulled me aside and was like, Do you want at a certain time, like, um, we can like make all the lights on the golf field. What is this called? I don't even know. <laughs> golf course, we can make it all be like the color and stuff. I'm like, that's so cute. I'm like, this is actually the after party. But that's good to know if you guys want to do a general reveal at Top Golf. That'd be really cute. But yeah, we're all here. Even Shine is here, cuddled up. And we got Kamaya, Paula, T Bell, Hi guys. Mel, Yasmin, Danny. I just skipped right over you, huh? <laughs> Yeah, we ordered hella food, and so it's nice food. and heated. This is the first time we've had these couch seats. Usually we get the table seats, and I like yeah, the couch. Yeah, I like the couch a lot more. Yeah. yeah. Oh, we got that on camera. Got that? We got that on we camera. We got it. Hey, y'all got that. <laughs> Wait, aren't you supposed to put it on that thing? There you go. It's not bad. Okay, hey, you hit it now, you just gotta work on form. Okay, okay. Wait, what's wrong with my form? Like, you were just bent over a lot. Oh, I bent over it like this? Then lift the clubs, keep your face down at the ball. Lift the club back, yeah. Yeah, you got some strokes. I got some? You do. Woo! Okay. You did that, Nas. You did that. <laughs> Y'all, we got so much food. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Guys, look, we're FaceTiming Kayla because we miss her. Mom knows. <laughs> we miss you. We wish you were here. We miss you, Kay. 
Oh, we'll see you soon. Yes, we love you. We have our girls' night on Friday. Oh, yeah. Arepas. Yeah, and Arepas. Hot tub. Yeah, and Hot Tub. At Naz's house Friday. Yes. <laughs> okay guys that is it for today's vlog i was just gonna kind of just end it and put in the outro and be like thanks for watching guys but i did want to come back on here because i want to talk about to all my fellow moms watching this all my fellow parents all my fellow toddler parents i could not close out this video without talking about how it was like a 180 or flight to ohio versus coming back home because i feel like we were more prepared for the flight back home because again like the first flight was kind of a trial run and then we picked up on some things and our flight back home was a lot more tolerable i'm not saying you know avon didn't have any tantrums i mean he's a toddler it's natural but it was definitely just a lot easier on us and a huge thing that we did is we got a child like harness type thing so you basically attach it to your um to the plane seat and it kind of makes the seat belt turn into a car seat like a traditional car seat and this was very important for us because a big problem we had on the first flight that i didn't mention was vaughn kept on standing up and also once he saw someone like open his belt like their seat belt he caught on to it so easily like it's actually very easy to take off a plain seat belt um so he just kept on taking it off and standing up in his seat and then the flight attendants would come by like he needs to sit in his seat and we're like we know like he just doesn't want to sit so getting that little harness was a lifesaver i think you can order off of amazon but mel actually got it in store at bye bye baby like right before our flight so i will link it for you guys down below but trust me if you guys are traveling with a toddler and you know they're not going to sit in their seat like ours get it like it definitely just made it so much easier also flights every single flight we've been on like when we asked for milk like two of the flights that we went on they had it, but they're like, oh, this is our last one. And then other flights like completely didn't have milk. I don't know if it's because of COVID or what's going on, but airplanes just don't have milk. So pack your own milk, okay? Whether you wanna do like fresh milk, if you're going on a long flight, maybe bring like powdered milk. But if your toddler needs milk, don't rely on the plane to have it because for some reason like not all planes have milk anymore i just thought they did but they don't we downloaded like an interactive like toddler game on our ipad and kayvon is not really an ipad kid we don't really have him on the ipad at all like just rarely we'll have him like watch something on there if we like go out to eat um but he loved that interactive little toddler game so i will find the exact one that's on mel's ipad i'll like put it on the screen i'll put it in the description box down below but that definitely kept vaughn entertained as well but when i tell you guys the conjunction of the harness and then also having milk made it so much easier and then also the flight back home was later in the day so vaughn got playtime before his flight so if it comes to booking your flight, definitely try to book a flight where you can get like some energy out of your toddler, whether you can take them to the park before or quite literally just have them run around the house before you take them on their flight. It will make a world of a difference. So I just couldn't close out this video without giving you guys some advice. You guys know that's what I'm here for. I always wanna be here to help you guys and give you all advice. So again, thank y'all so much for watching. And again, this was just like our week at a glance for um, our trip back home to Ohio. Make sure you guys watch the gender reveal vlog as well as Kayvon's birthday week vlog because you guys are going to see some um, more scenes from this week in those videos. Make sure you guys click the links down below and also check out Albert to get your $150 when you guys open an account. And we'll see you guys for our next video. Bye everyone.